In this session, we will be discussing the code of displaying the banners in JavaScript. Okay, so basically, banners are used for advertisements. They are generally images which, when clicked, direct you to a URL where there is a detailed description about the advertisement. So generally, it is used for advertisement purpose. Now, let us see the code. In this, we have taken an HTML file. In the head part, we are writing the script. But before going to the script, let us first see what we have written in the body part. I'm highlighting it over here. So here is the start of the body. On the load of the HTML page, that is on the onload event, I'm calling a function called as show banners. This function will be responsible for displaying the banners. Then I have taken a uh, anchor tag and its reference that is href I have set to javascript colon show links. So this is the way where I will be calling the function and the function will be showing the banners one after the another. Okay. And then I'm having an image tag. So basically I'm creating an anchor for the image and in the image I'm having the first banner that is banner1.jpg. I have set the width and height for this image and I have given the name as change banner. So this is the HTML part. Now let us go to the script part. Now I'll highlight the script part that we have written. We have taken the language as JavaScript. Then I have taken an array that called my banners in this i have loaded four images then we also require one more array for storing the links for every image that we have taken in our image array so i have created a new array called as my banner links which are containing the four links for the four images that we have included earlier now i'm setting the banner variable to zero this is required for the loop function now we are writing a function called show links in this function we are just uh, setting the href property of the location element that is the document navigation okay so the location property uh, is used for setting the href property and this we are setting to the link which is present at the banner location so if it is the zero image then that time the zero link that is the link present at the zero location of this array will be present over there Secondly, if it is the first image, uh, sorry, second image, then the link which is present at the second location will be shown. Okay. So, depending upon which image is shown in the banner, accordingly, the link will get updated. And for this, we are maintaining a variable called as banner. Now, this is the function which we have called on the load event of the web page. So, what this function is going to do? This is the function called show banners. We are checking if the document.images, that means if there are images present in the particular uh, element, then we are incrementing the value of the banner variable. If this banner variable reaches the end of your my banners array, then we need to start from the first. So we are resetting the banner variable to zero. And then we have taken the image name as change banner. So we are setting the source of this change banner present in the document to my banners and the location of the banner variable. So initially it will load the zeroth image. When the zeroth image will be loaded, uh, by default, the show link function will update the link for it. Similarly, and uh, similarly when the banner variable become one, at time it will go to one and this uh, function which we have called so show banners function is called on the load event and show links function gets called every time your image is changed okay so whenever the href property of this location needs to be reset that time the show links function will be called so as the image gets changed that time this function show links gets called and the show link function will update the href property of your anchor tag to the current banner link which is to be displayed okay and we are changing the banners after a gap of 5000 milliseconds for that we have used the function set timeout so set timeout function has two parameters over here first one is show banners that is the function which is to be called and second is the time interval after which it is to be called so every, after every 5000 milliseconds or five seconds the show banners function will be called it will display the next banner and accordingly it will update the link okay 
So this is how you can display the banners using HTML and the combination of JavaScript using two arrays, my banners and my banner links and using two functions that is show banners and show banner links. So this is how you will be able to display the banner. The output of this will be shown in the next video. Thank you.